friends welcome back to ET Standard channel today we are going to check out Haveli Bistro it used to be called Indian Haveli and they have recently renovated it couple years back and now it's reopened and they have lunch specials every day from 11 to 3 chana putura is one of their popular items that we are going to check out today and they also have paranthas veg thali and non veg thali so it used to be a little run down but after the renovation now they call it bistro so you can see it is quite spacious good for your team meetings good for large family gatherings they don't have separate room but they can accommodate larger groups and it's quite spacious it's quite big so we are checking out their thali an appetizer and chana padura veg thali that i ordered consisted of dal makhani you can see dollops of butter on dal fluffy naan of course there is raita which basically yogurt with some seasoning sometimes they have cucumber and stuff in it uh, pickled onions veggies and two vegetables so vegetable wise the flavors were spot on i had rich creamy paneer dish and mixed vegetable sufficient for one person but really two people can um, share it too and you can always take the leftovers the staff was really kind they allow you to take some containers and you can pour the leftovers if you're not able to finish it and there is a little bit of a variation in this menu every day i've had lunch here with some colleagues so variety good food if you are craving indian vegetarian thali or non-veg thali this is a place you can definitely check out it's on king george boulevard close to superstore there is a bimo michael's across from costco actually so this was the tandoori uh, chicken we had ordered it was dry the mint chutney and squeeze of lemon did make it edible but um, you know it could have been better so the most talked about dish that people come here for is their chana patura you can see this fluffy patura so patura is basically deep fried indian bread if you don't know it comes with raita uh, chana sabzi and of course pickles as well so you can see this is heavenly it's delicious it's sufficient for two to three people actually but of course it depends on one's appetite so onions pickles so salad what they call salad the uh, raita chole patura chola patura plate for 14 bucks delicious if you're craving some brunch items on a weekend or a weekday i wouldn't recommend ordering um, tandoori chicken looks amazing taste wise a little bit on the drier side of course edible and uh, thali is your bang for your buck so 18 to 20 dollars for veg thali non-veg thali variation in the menu on everyday basis the flavors are spot on it's a great treat if you want indian food you want to take your colleagues your white friends or you want to go hang out with your indian friends nice clean atmosphere and really good way to enjoy some indian food with variety of vegetables non-veg thali comes with two pieces of chicken tikka veg curry bar chicken or lamb curry rice naan and you can see veg lunch special dal bakhani is always there and there are two types of vegetable curry that you can choose from and of course there is rice and naan i wish they had some swedish too i don't think swedish was part of it but that can take it to next level but otherwise it was eight and a half nine out of ten for sure not the chicken but definitely uh, the thali thanks for checking out haveli bistro with us guys share this video with a foodie and we hope that you do subscribe to our channel eat east indian where we bring variety of food dishes to you recipes reviews and other tasty um, food items